YouTubers and Madden fans, this is Madden Money Shop bringing you some more gameplay footage. There he is, the man, Barry Sanders. The celebration! Madden Harvest. This gameplay footage, by the way, is a little bit old. This is not like brand new. I had Barry Sanders a while back, um, and I told you guys I would put out the Barry Sanders footage um, if the last video I put out, which was basically comparing Barry Sanders to Earl Campbell, which one I thought was best. I'll pop a link for that and try to put it in the description if you guys want to check that out. That was more geared towards Earl Campbell, who I still think is the best running back in this game. I'm trying out Herschel Walker right now. Um, I don't know. You know, I haven't had, I, I, at the time that I recorded this video, the audio anyway, um, I can't say that I had too much time with him. But I'm really trying to see, like, who's the best back out there for a good value. I mean, I basically, um, you know, Barry Sanders is basically, um, you know, you're going to see him in this video, basically. Uh, but there you go. First play of the game. I <laughs> get a kick return touchdown. I don't know who that is. I think that's when I had Tyreek Hill, who actually sold. I wish I had him back. <laughs> He's such a good player. But at the same time, I got Jarvis Landry now, who's, you know, He's free. You know what I mean? I can't, he's a gnat. I can't get rid of him. So I have him returning kicks, and he's pretty good. But you can see Tyreek Hill, obviously, is much better. So this guy right out the gate, he's basically playing from behind with a hurry up because of that. Uh, that happens. Uh, this, you know, whenever – to inexperienced players, I should say that happens. More experienced players don't get flustered by that. It is what it is. I don't get flustered. But I don't care, especially in the first quarter. Uh, but either way, like I said, this video is about Barry Sanders. I said I would put that out. Uh, when I made the Earl Campbell video, uh, but basically, like I said, I still feel like Earl Campbell's the better card, uh, but I have some success with him for sure. So here we go. He's rolling out. My defense is going to get after in this game. You're going to see that quite a bit. Uh, Cam Newton, I think he has the flashback Cam, who still is probably my second favorite quarterback uh, in Madden this year <laughs> by Michael Vick. I mean, Michael Vick is, is such a monster. You're going to see him quite a bit in this. Uh, third and seven, though. Here we go. We get that user lurk. Um, that's uh, that's the most feared Kendricks. I was really trying to buy Lawrence Taylor um, in this market crash, but I can't because Michael Kendricks is the best linebacker in the game. <laughs> like, like legit, like he's one of the top five linebackers in this game. I got him and I got most feared Ray Lewis, and it's it's a toss up. I really feel like he's better than most feared Ray Lewis, <laughs> the commander Ray Lewis, the 94 overall Ray Lewis. But it's you know I I can't really make that assumption. So here we go. We're going for some one play touchdowns. Uh, I'll try to pop a link for that one play touchdown right there. Uh, I noticed watching myself play these games, by the way, when I watch them after the fact, uh, that I play like an asshole. I really do. <laughs> You're going to see quite a few one-play touchdowns. That's just a, like, that's really like a dick move, really, like the one-play touchdown. <laughs> it looks like it anyway. So here we go. He's um, he's running that hurry up again. Um, you know, like I said, inexperienced, man. Like, sometimes you got to slow the game down. It's like if you're taking a beating, I don't think speeding up the beating is going to make it any any less bad. Uh, but he's actually running some, like, weird little formation where he's getting, like, a cluster of dudes, like, all in one area. So first and ten, he does slow it down. You can tell by the way that I let the uh, the play stop there. So he's taking off. Like, this this here, this is this is annoying as shit. Is he, he embarrasses me by going to the house with the quarterback. Anytime you house it with a quarterback, that's, that's a really big F you. <laughs> So he just embarrassed me with that. So we're going to go right back to playing like an asshole. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to chuck it up on a cover four again. Um, and this is why, to me, Michael Vick is the best player in the game. He has unlimited arm strength. As you see, I throw it out to Randy Moss. He's like 5, 10 yards behind everybody. Like, that's the... For the people out there that like to play um, cover four the entire game, you're... I can't stand those people, by the way. It doesn't matter to me. But, like, they're just such idiots. Like, I play people that play cover four on the goal line. Like, what are you doing? Like, that's not football at all. It's not like, I'm not trying to say, like, you're cheesy or whatever. Because I don't really don't care. I got plays for that. But I'm just saying, like, for people that play cover four on the goal line, what are you afraid of? There's no way the ball is going to get behind you. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, so, and there's people that do that, I swear. So, fourth and two, we're going to have to step up here. I gave him a big lane right to the gut. And he's got his own Barry Sanders, um, who I didn't see in the opening card, so I don't know if he's doing A lot of people do that where they, where they put a guy with the right chem in the starting spot and then they just rotate out the real player. 
So you never know if this is the baby goat version that he's grown or if it's, you know, the actual Barry Sanders. You never know. But everybody seems to have Barry Sanders now. So it, who, who knows? But either way, fourth and eight, uh, we got to get a stop here. You're going to see me with uh, my man. Um, you know, I was covering everything out there. And Reggie White just comes with the sack. Reggie White had a really good stretch for me for a while. He's no longer on the on my team. As I'm actually, I'm actually currently looking for a new defensive end. So there we get some nice jukes. Barry Sanders with his first carry. I don't know if Barry Sanders is better. I just don't use him enough. Because you're going to see him get used right here. I mean, they, they just, the dude's just didn't stand a chance. You know, <laughs> he's just like out on an island with Barry Sanders. There's no chance. There's no chance at all. So uh, you can see I'm having success with him. It's just, I, I don't know, man. I just like I just like that pounding back. You know what I'm saying? I like physical football. I know the NFL's not that way anymore. But I really like defense, punch you in the mouth, and uh, physical pounding running backs. And Barry Sanders, Barry Sanders is one of my all-time favorite players. I didn't see the dude play live. But I just love watching them YouTube clips, man. Same thing with Earl Campbell, though. I mean, he's got some nasty YouTube clips, too. But either way, man, I mean, I love Barry Sanders, man. He's just definitely my favorite all-time players. Uh, I just don't feel comfortable with pounding the rock with him. I just feel like he's just not built for that right up the gut. So, I mean, sweet place for sure. So, either way, 28-7. You would have thought this guy would quit by now, but he's showing a little bit of heart, man. He's coming out here. He's just throwing the ball a lot. Um... You know, I wish he'd quit because this is a weekend league, and I, <laughs> I like to move on. I, I don't I actually don't like it when people stick around too long. I have people that disagree with me on the, in the comment section about that, but I'd rather just move on, bro. Like, this, there's only, you know, two, three days to get in 25 games. Like, let me move on, man. The game's done. You know what I'm saying? It's an old-school Madden rule. Like, man, you go up 21 nothing or 21-point you know, twenty one point lead, it's game over. So there he actually has some BS, a nice animation, but that's okay. i got to throw it over the top again. <laughs> Because you're still in cover four. Like, how did you not learn by now to get out of cover four? It didn't work out that time. But you know it's gonna. So, uh, I don't even know what happened there. I fast-forwarded a little bit because it's 35-14. Um, and this is not really a game anymore. I get the user lurk. This is the beginning. Of, actually, I know what happened. It was the beginning of the second half. I get the user lurk and score. And he finally quit. So, let's just speed this along, bro. Oh, God damn it, you're wasting my time. 40-14 is what it took for you to wake up and get out of the game. Like, come on, man. Move on. So, basically, uh, we're going to go to another game. Another little half a game here. This guy's got a much better team, though. He's got the RG3 Thursday night card. I wonder how much that costs. I mean, that's uh, that's definitely a neat card. So, first play of the game. We're doing it again. We're just bombing it up. And he doesn't catch it, though. I mean, he had a little, little bit better coverage. But you know what? I don't learn my lesson. We're going to do that again. Because he's still running cover four, bruh. That's for all them cover four noobs out there just run it over and over and over and over. We're going to get behind that defense eventually, even if it's only by a yard. And Randy Mouse, Randy Mouse the boss is gone. And that's... I love playing defense like that, man. You want to go ahead and just play back? Play back. It's whatever. Um, so here, we're running some heavy blitzes, and it, it catches up with me eventually. You can't always run these all-out blitzes, uh, but you can see here, I mean, I get some nice... Uh, I mean, I just love Steve Atwater. Like, I just got um, a Ronnie Lock card, and I, I want to upgrade to maybe Ed Reeve. I will never, ever bench my Steve Atwater. I just can't. He's so nice. Like, he's the best player in the game. So here we go. We're going to go. We're going to get the Barry Sanders. This is what I'm talking about, man. Like, to me, you see how nasty Randy Moss and Mike Vick are? Like, they are just glitches. Like, I just, they, they run the game for me. Here we go. We're taking off uh, with Michael Vick. I'm going to step up and try to get that touch, but I go out of bounds at the, at the four uh, with a little fumble. No big deal. Take the field goal. But, like I'm saying, compare these guys. You know what I'm saying? They're all 94s. To me, Randy Moss, best receiver in the game. To me, Michael Vick, best quarterback in the game, only, only 93. This guy gets a nice big play. That's what happens when you play too tight a coverage, but it is what it is. So to me, those two are the best two. I thought having a three of them together would be so dirty. But at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? When you see the job that Randy Moss is doing and the job that Michael Vick is doing, I mean, I'm trying right now with my boy Barry. I mean, I, maybe I don't give him the ball enough, but he's not doing the OP. Look at this. I got another one. And that was, that was there, but it's just a bad throw by, by Vick. Uh, but you're just going to see, like I said, I'm going to try it again. Uh, these won't play touchdowns. My, Randy Moss is just such an OP win games for you player, and I don't feel like Barry Sanders is. There, I take the, the check down because um, of the heat. But uh, we'll see. We're going to get these one-play touchdowns. I'm going to keep doing it. Here, we're going to the other side, getting sacked. <laughs> I'm going to keep doing these one-play touchdowns until he figures it out. Um, they'll eventually hit. Like I said, they're not 100%, but you only got to hit one out of four downs for it to be worth it. So here's against the cover four. We're doing it again, waiting for him to clear that, and we got some good defense out there. So, uh, you know, didn't quite get past, but you know what? It is what it is. So we punt the ball away. You're going to see those one-play touchdowns will get there eventually. I get a little bit too formulaic because we get a nice user lurk. I mean, you know, them, them lurking skills, man. I'm just all over the ball. That was Ray Lewis. I, like I said, I typically do it uh, with my man, um, you know, Kendrick's butts, whatever. So here, we're going to go ahead. We're going to hit the Randy Moss. Once again, like I said, this guy is a glitch. Even if it's not a bombing up touchdown, he's still an amazing athlete. You can throw it out to the flats and take it in for 15 yards in. Like I said, I don't have a problem with Barry. 
I just don't think that when I when I think about him in terms of he should be the elite like like Moss and Vic are to me. He's just not getting it done the same way they are. So here we go. We're gonna pick it off. Like I said, Steve Atwater, man. If you don't have this guy, I don't care if I don't care where you're at in life in this game. Get Steve Atwater. So that's the last play of the game. Actually, he quits out after that. That's why I slowed down. We're gonna show that. Uh, but that's it, man. If you guys want to see more gameplay footage, do me a favor, hit the like button. I'll do that. Other than that, thanks for watching, Mad Money. Shout out. If you need more help or just want to show your support, then head over to my Patreon and join my team, where you can get exclusive content like eBooks and bonus plays, as well as early access to my vids and more. Link in the description below. 